Hi, I'm John Grove, and this is the Two Minute Message. I was reading a devotional recently written by an 18th century Christian writer on the topic of prayer. He said something that I found quite interesting. He said, it's actually possible to pray without words. Not only without words coming out of the mouth, but even without words in the head sometimes. I think what he meant was, in the Bible it tells us that inside of us there's a center called the mind and a center called the heart or spirit. That's why in Philippians it says that when we pray, he guards our hearts and minds in Christ Jesus and in his peace. The mind is objective, the spirit is intuitive. The mind is more about thinking, the spirit is more about feelings. One expresses itself with words, the other expresses itself with groans. To be a well-balanced and a healthy person, we have to be aware and sensitive to both. Not long ago, our washing machine at home was making a funny rumbling sound. I wondered what it was and my wife explained to me, well all the wet clothes had gone to one side in the spin cycle. All we had to do is open the lid and spread them out, close it, and then it ran just fine. In the same way, if we focus more on the mind, we're unbalanced. If we focus more on the spirit, we're unbalanced. But if we focus on both, then we have the well-balanced life. This is why in 1 Corinthians 14, 15, it says, I will pray with the spirit and I will pray with the mind also. So friends, be right, but be deep. Think with the mind, but listen with the spirit.